Hi everyone, welcome back to Ground Zero. Now, I'm sure most of us will agree that a safety deposit box is your best bet if you're looking for a place to store your valuables. But what about using it to carry stuff around in? Well, I'm not sure, Kenneth, but I know one woman seems to think so. Stomper Flowerpot Pam was amused to see this girl carrying a huge safe out of Singapore immigration towards Johor Bahru. Reported Flowerpot Pam, I saw this amazing pretty girl yesterday at the Singapore immigration. Instead of the usual luggage, she was actually carrying a safe box heading in, into Johor Bahru. Flowerpot Pam wasn't alone in his or her sighting of this woman with the safe. Stomper's comments revealed two other videos that observers had shot of the woman on her journey to the immigration point on board bus number 170. Now this odd little sighting got netizens a buzz. Some were amazed at how the woman seemed to be breaking no sweat at all despite carrying the supposedly huge weight in her arms. Stomper Stomp regular commented, She's strong, you know. Do you know how heavy such a big size safe can be? She must be like Wonder Woman or something. Stomper Jurassic joked that the woman's feet could only have been possible if the safe were made of paper. Said the Stomper, the real box is very heavy. I think this is paper made box. She wanted to burn it in Malaysia for ancestors' <laughs> blessing. More money coming now. <laughs> Stomper Baby Jack commented, Why, if a safe can be carried like that, right? then it's not really safe anymore, right? Yeah. Any skinny little thief can just come and make away with your safe, right? Stomper Super Dollar expressed his concern. What's she doing walking around with a safe anyway? Is she a staff? If not, why security didn't stop her and check? It's the immigration for God's sake. Now, while some stompers worried about over the woman and her intentions, others were drawn to the face of a particular man standing behind her on the escalator. He had an ex equally curious expression on his face as well. Stomper Thom Thom joked, Poor gal, oblivious of two chaps eyeing her. A safe <laughs> like that is quite weighty. She hardly broke a sweat having it about. But the trophy goes to her bodyguard, the chap right behind her. <laughs> if looks could kill... And with that, we conclude this week's episode of Ground Zero. Thanks for joining us and remember to tune in next week when we bring you more great citizen journalism. Remember to go to storm.com.sg for more. Bye-bye.